Today I'm going to cook for you three dishes, uh, which is Siba Ceviche, one of them, which is a very traditional uh, dish from Peru. Then we move to a scallop stiradito, which we have influences from Japan, mixing with the rocotto pepper. And the third one will be octopus with white quinoa and botija olives. The ceviche or cibas is a traditional Peruvian dish. People do it in lots of different ways, it depends on the region. The main ingredients there are limes, coriander, ginger, onions, garlic, a lot of lime juice. We here we blast chill the fish to minus 32 degrees. It, your fish has to be very fresh and then obviously we cut it in small pieces according to the taste obviously. Chop the onions, chop the garlic, one thumb of ginger peeled and grated, a little bit of salt, leave it in the fridge for around half an hour, then pass it through a fine sieve to sort of uh, get the flavors to start work together. Chop some coriander, add it into it, chop some chiles, add it into the mix. And the chiles and the coriander, the ginger, which is we will give us the flavor to, to, to enhance the dish. And then to, to the, this liquid, we, you will add the fresh limes, squeeze fresh limes. The fresh limes will cook the fish instantly, around two, three minutes will take. The scallops, obviously, it, it comes from Brixham, from the UK. Fresh scallops, you have to blast chill it again, you have to slice them. Uh, here we use the, the Japanese influence in Peru, okay, the way of cutting, the way of maybe treating the fish, or the, or the shellfish in this case. And we have a, a, a chile, which is very famous, well known, and we use it in all of our dishes in the country. It's called rocotto pepper. It's very hot. We have to blanch it eight times in different changes of water and then obviously get the flavor and a little bit of the heat. Otherwise, it's too hot. Uh, some um, chia seeds, which comes from the Andes of Peru, and some amaranth leaves. A little bit of olive oil, salt, and that's it. The octopus dish, obviously, we have to cook the octopus first. We have an octopus called double saca, we bring it from Portugal. You have to cook it uh, around 32 minutes to 40 minutes maximum. Then leave it in the same liquid to chill down, cut it in small pieces. Braise them with a little bit of achote. Achote is a seed that we bring it from the Amazon of Peru, which gives a um, neutral taste, but gives a sort of nice color. Then we move to the quinoa. The quinoa, white quinoa, we mix with a little bit of um, mayonnaise, mixed with onion, garlic, lemon juice, and lime juice, and orange juice inside. So it's becoming a little bit citrus, with the citrus flavor. And we put the braised octopus on the top. And we finish with the uh, botija olives. Botija olives are uh, Peruvian olives that they are purple in color. So we make a mayonnaise with these uh, olives. And it has to go uh, hot, to the table.